Hello and welcome to Master Tech Corner. I'm your host, Brad Watkins. I'm a Master Diagnostic Technician at Volkswagen North Scottsdale. Dealer code 422231. Today I'm going to demonstrate how to do a voltage drop of a charging system circuit. A voltage drop is a great way to determine internal resistance of a wire. If you have internal resistance in your wire, say the charging cable or the alternator cable, that can lead to low charging voltage. And you may think you have a bad alternator when in reality you have a bad alternator cable. So today I'm going to demonstrate the positive side voltage drop and the negative side voltage drop. You want to make sure you do both positive and negative just to make sure everything in that system is operating as it should. Now Volkswagen specification for voltage drop is 0.3 volts. So anything under 0.3 volts, you're in the clear. Anything over 0.3 volts, then whatever wire you're testing is faulty. Now you want to do a voltage drop with all loads on and you can also do it at an increased RPM. That will increase the load across that wire. Now, if you increase it excessively, say four or 5,000 RPMs, that may be too high and that could kind of offset the test. So maybe, you know, 2,000 RPMs will be a good range. We're gonna turn all the loads on, so AC, all the lights, and we're gonna check that system that way. Now, to do that, you need a digital volt ohmmeter, you need to set it on DC volts. Now, I'm gonna demonstrate that for you right now. Okay, now we're gonna perform the voltage drop and the charging system circuit. We're gonna start with the charging system positive side. Before we do anything though, we need to make sure that the battery voltage is fully charged. Okay, 12.87, slightly overcharged, but the engine was running, so it's gonna be a little higher. Now. First thing we're going to do is we're going to start the engine, turn all the loads on, increase the RPMs. Now we have all the loads on. We're going to start by the positive side of the system. We go from the positive post of the battery. The post of the alternator where the cable is attached. 0.22 volts voltage drop. That's across the entire charging system circuit positive side. Now we're going to take it one step further, we're going to go to the alternator cable, adjust the cable isolated, 0.19, okay that's below specification, 0.3, we're going to go across the fuse panel, by itself, 0.02, and we're going to go positive cable from the fuse panel to the battery, 0 0.010, very, very minimal. All right, now we're gonna do the negative side. So start, we're gonna go battery negative to the case of the alternator, 0 0.05 across the entire negative side of the voltage drop system, the charging system. Then we're gonna bring it over here Right where the negative cable connects to the body. Zero. Really good. So, between the negative post and the case of the alternator, across the, also across the cable at the transmission to the body, we are at zero at the negative side. And then we have 0 0.05 across the whole negative side of the circuit. This concludes our demonstration of the charging system circuit voltage drop. From Master Tech Corner, I'm Brad Watkins. Thank you.